and I'm the owner and creator here at Soy in Shea. January 2018 saw the release of our very first monthly mystery box and today we're going to go and take a look and see what was inside this package. So come with me. All mystery boxes will come gift wrapped and this makes them perfect if you need a birthday gift, Mother's Day gift, anything like that. You know that you can go online order the mystery box and they're going to receive a gift wrapped product. There is no invoicing in the box so you don't need to worry about that either. So we'll take a look and see what's inside the January mystery box. So once we open it up and we remove the tissue paper we can see we have quite a few full sized items in this box. Now the January box focused on hands and feet this month. So the first thing we have here, this is a artisan bar of soap which was created especially for the January mystery box and it's scented in champagne and strawberries. We have um, a little lip balm tube in here as well. Now the lip balms will vary in flavours. So we have over 20 fragrances in the range or 20 flavours in the range. Um, so they may not be this chocolate bonbons but there's lots of other really good flavours. All the lip balms are made um, by myself and they do not include any petroleum jelly. The, they mainly contain things such as beeswax, coconut oil, castor oil, avocado oil and cocoa butter as well as a bit of added vitamin E. Okay so another product that was in the mystery box is something I currently already stock and they were the shower fizzes and I included one of each in there. Now the shower fizzes they're a disc very similar to a bath bomb but these sit into the base of your shower tray and as the water touches them they dissolve and fizz away and as the steam comes back up off the base of your shower it brings those aromas up so they're really good if you don't actually have a bathtub within your um, bathroom or if you just can't be bothered to run the bath you still get that experience of a bath bomb they come in three fragrances we've got uplifting which is perfect for a morning shower relaxing which is great for night time and refresh now the refresh one has got menthol crystal peppermint and eucalyptus essential oils in them so these are perfect in winter so the rest of the items in this box are all products that are going to be released in february so those that ordered the mystery boxes were the very first to try these products what we have here are some mani pedi bombs so I included one of each of the three fragrances that will be released which include Victorian Roses, Lavender, Cucumber, Ginger and Mint. And the idea behind these is that you get three little mini bombs within this box, very similar to the bath bombs, however these don't make bubbles. I've used buttermilk and Takuma butter in these and the idea would be that you'd run yourself a bowl of warm water and then you'd soak either your hands or feet in them and the Takuma butter and the buttermilk are really softening on the skin so it just prepares your hands or feet for a manicure or pedicure or it could just be something as just a little bit of luxury to soak your feet after a really busy day. So um, the mystery box had one of each of those and these will be available in February for anyone who hasn't purchased the mystery box. So another item we have in here which will be released in February is the pumice and salt foot scrub. This is an emulsified foot scrub and that means that there's a few other ingredients in there that as the water touches the scrub when you're applying it it almost turns it into a lotion so an emulsified scrub is always going to be more moisturizing than say a normal salt scrub would be now with this foot scrub I've scented it with lavender fragrance oil and also with rosemary and peppermint essential oils. It's been made using hemp seed oil and avocado oil as well as shea and cocoa butter and these are all very skin softening um, products so that's a real treat for your feet. Now personally I'm not the sort of person that likes having um, my feet touched but I love using this on my feet so the pumice um, really changes the texture salt scrubs I find to be a little bit too rough and that I don't like that texture whereas the pumice makes it a lot more softer but still exfoliates the feet well and then the final product that we got in here was a foot cream 
It's a nice thick cream um, designed um, specially for after having an exfoliating um, scrub and it's also been scented with peppermint essential oil. It's also made with the shea and cocoa butter as well and there is um, also the lavender and rosemary oil in there. Now even though it is a nice thick luscious cream it doesn't leave your feet feeling greasy. Often I find I put cream on my feet and then I walk on tiles and I'm slipping everywhere. I've actually formulated this so that you don't have that after slippery feel on your feet. So that was this month's box. So if we pull that out of the way and we'll just have another quick look. So just a quick recap of what was in the box. So we have a full bar of champagne and strawberry soap. We had a lip balm tube. We have three of the shower fizzes, one of each of the current fragrances. Plus we had three boxes of the new Manny Petty Bombs. We also had the emulsified pumice and salt scrub plus the foot cream. I am currently working on the February box and once that's ready to be released I will let you know via the um, via my Facebook page which I'll leave links to down below. So I hope you enjoyed taking a look at what was inside the January mystery box. Thank you. Bye.